enough to notice. 38 is what it feels like in Tappahannock, 40 over in South Hill. Now all these rain showers are moving quite quickly, around 40 miles an hour. So even though they've got a quick path, they're still bringing a lot of water. And of course, since a lot of people are teleworking, we're seeing ponding out on the roadways that tend to stick around for a little bit longer because they don't get mixed up as fast. As we head into the 9 o'clock hour, still dealing with those heavy showers, predominantly northern neck and middle peninsula. And we'll see some of that wraparound moisture from that low pressure system that will slide its way off the coast as we head into the 1, 2, and 3 o'clock hours up along I-95, northern neck, middle peninsula, Hampton Roads. Areas just off to the west, you will still be cloudy, but you're not going to be as wet as that system begins to push its way through. Sunshine is back tomorrow, accompanied with some six and then it truly is a roller coaster ride going from there. 51 degrees today will continue to have those clouds with us all afternoon long. As far as the heavy, most steady rain, it's happening right now, and it will eventually move its way off the coast around lunchtime. We'll still see a few sprinkles, but not that intense rain that's also going to limit your visibility. Tomorrow, a lot of sunshine, a high of 64 degrees, followed by 80 on Friday. Very slim chance for showers. Definitely a day you can still get outside and play and run some of those errands. 65 over into Saturday, 80 back again Sunday before that sunshine continues, but cools off heading into Monday and Tuesday. Rob, Reba. All right, thanks.